I'm Peter Janish. I'm team lead for uh, Project Delivery Group, looking after the treatment plants as program. We're at the Bain Huon Water Treatment Plant. Uh, what we're doing is uh, some upgrades for system optimization, upgrading filter to, to waste and automating that. We're upgrading the return from the lagoons. We're putting in some flow meters and we're upgrading bits and pieces of SCADA. And we've also upgraded the service pumps um, in the plant here so they can provide water across the site. We've installed a couple of bypass valves, so we're not returning contaminated water back to the plant here when it's out of spec. What we can do is bring, bring that back into spec, then start returning the water. The other reason is, uh, from an efficiency point of view, if the treatment plant does go down, operations generally are over an hour away to come back into the plant here. What automating them will do, they'll be able to access those valves via the, our SCADA system and initiate a recovery process before they come back into site rather than coming back into site and taking four to five hours with the process initiated off site by the time they get here. Saves them a couple of hours in terms of recovery of the plant and producing fresh water for the public. My name's Adam Cohen and I'm a water operator at Taz Water. It makes it easier for us operators to operate the plant when it's out of spec. Um, so generally the field of waste has been a manual system which the closest operator is nearly an hour away. So those late nights when it's one or two o'clock in the morning, you can get up rem remotely log on, start it up, start the field of the waste system, do any dose changes that need be, and then start coming in and improve the plant. Some of the works will actually help us uh, maintain um, top quality water to, to the local region, but all the works are being done with um, plant being shut down for, for short periods of time and then being brought back on at the end of the day with no threat to water supplies.